can be scary driving here in Southwest Florida. You never know what to expect when you get behind the wheel. That's why the Lee County Sheriff is adding a new unit. It's called LCSO Highway Patrol. The night beats Justin Case is live in studio. Justin, what changes can we expect to see out on the streets? Well, some brand new vehicles. There are going to be some unbelievable new rides coming to the Lee County Sheriff's Office to this new Highway Patrol division. Of course, these are going to be Hellcat Challengers, and they are new, they're a part of this brand new division that will keep all of us safe. Now, the sheriff says these new cruisers are equipped to conduct high-risk traffic stops and help deputies target serious, dangerous drivers. Is it just me or is it getting crazier out there? Well, if you live and drive in Southwest Florida, you might agree with that statement. I called my mom and kept calling and kept calling. I said, hey, is that OK? And she actually wasn't sure. And we kept calling and kept calling. And it probably was, what, about less than an hour that um, we found out that it was actually him in the car accident. These memory lanes are paved with heartbreak for so many families. Chances are you've seen a crash. Maybe you've been in one. Heck, most of us get stuck in the backups from crashes on our daily commutes. In 2023, my deputies worked almost 19,000 crashes and we are just over 7,000 already in 2024. That's Lee County Sheriff Carmine Marcino and the stats he just gave are for Lee County alone. As of today, we are introducing the Lee County Sheriff's Office Highway Patrol. The assets behind me are the tools that you will see everywhere in this county every single day. Deputies in these new Hellcat Challengers will be going after the people putting you and I in danger on Lee County roadways every day. FDOT's also not standing idly by. They have plans to eliminate seven left turns along State Road 82. Plus, they'll be adding a traffic light to 82 and Sunshine. Wink News anchor Emma Heaton wrote along with a deputy who told her these changes mean fewer people will die on these roads. And I think would be a lifesaver, honestly, because there have been many a times where I've worked fatal crashes or serious crashes because of people making left-hand turns. So as for the changes coming to State Road 82 that aim to improve safety there, we have all the information about where those turns are, including the light that's going to be added to 82 and sunshine. All that is available with this story on WinkNews.com. Back to you.